So before we begin the video, I just want to say sorry for not uploading as consistently as you know I should have. I'm not really making an excuse, but I do apologize for not uploading more card tricks. Um, anyways, today I am going to be doing a collaboration with Card Mechanics. So if you like this, uh, the performance I'm going to do, you go to his channel, you watch the tutorial, and if you end up liking his video, uh, then obviously subscribe. So I do, I do like his channel a lot. Like I said, guys, you can always email me, you know, asking if you want to make a video together. And uh, if I like your channel, I'll say yes. So, anyways, guys, here is the uh, performance for the trick. All right, so here's how you would start off the trick. So you could begin just shuffling up the deck. Uh, you didn't have the spectator shuffle up. It doesn't really matter. It's a completely random card, right? All you got to do, you just have them pick any card. In this case, we have the king of hearts. Now, what you do is the uh, the entire trick is kind of based off of soulmates. So essentially, you can go off and tell the spectators, all right, so the soulmate of the king of hearts would be the king of diamonds, right? Now, these, these are two special cards. You know, they're always looking to find one another because, you know, they are... Uh, soulmate. So what you do is you go through the deck and you tell your spectre, let's go ahead and look for it really quick. In this case, the soulmate of the king of hearts here, the king of diamonds, you tell them, all right, so it's somewhere, you know, in the middle of the deck and, you know, you don't really know exactly where it is, but it's somewhere in there. And if, you, and if they don't believe you, you can go ahead, you can mix up the deck a little bit and just kind of get everything mixed up, right? So what you try to do is separate these two cards as much as you can from each other until they eventually have to find each other again, right? So that's the whole story. You take their card, you take the soulmate, and then what you do is you can tell your spectators, all right, so go ahead and shuffle up this deck a little more. All right, so they shuffle it up once more, and you say, all right, so go ahead and say stop whenever you want, or you could have them shuffle it up and then cut the deck wherever they want to. So let's say they were to say, all right, so stop here, right? So anywhere in the deck they happen to stop, you sell as a completely fair break. You take their card, you put it directly in the middle, wherever they said stop, you snap your fingers, and just like that, guys, the soulmates, even though you've been shuffling up the deck, as you guys can see, right below their card should be the soulmate, the king of diamonds. So this is a trick, and if you guys want to learn how to do it, make sure to go over to Card Mechanic, and he will show you how, and do not forget to subscribe. She's a literal vampire, barely goblin, bobbling, bouncing after you.